guys and girls and welcome back to Gamers Play Sims 3. Yes, when we left off, Jack was being just as responsible as he always is and, you know, doing his homework and stuff like that, like normal. Well, he wasn't actually doing his homework, but just seems a bit too responsible to be a teenager. Doesn't smoke, doesn't drink, doesn't do any of that jazz, um, like we were saying. <laughs> and we had the repair technician, I can't remember her name, but she was around fixing the shower and the, no, not the shower, the computer and the sink. Because that had left a load of water all over the place that Kate Pistachio, the maid, had to clear up. Now, everybody's asleep. It's really boring when think people go to sleep. Except for Jack. He was watching children's programs on the telly, but instead, what are you doing? Play computer games. Oh, you want to sleep? Look, you can sleep. There's one side of the bed that's completely free. Sleep. Sleep. Go on, sleep. Go on, Jack. What? What's wrong with sleeping there? Uh, so I'm going to have to get a third bed, unless I can get Ryan and G-Play to flirt enough to be able to, you know, become girlfriend, boyfriend, sleep in the same bed, that sort of thing. So, yeah, that's going to have to be the target, I think. That's going to be the goal. We have to try and get those two together. But, uh, Madam here still hasn't been to the dive bar, really. So, actually, let's have a look. When are you next at work? Uh, ooh! It's a day off. Fantastic. It may be a Sunday morning, but there might still be some people out clubbing. So, we're going to send you to the dive bar and see if we can get you to make some friends. Dive bar. Visit Wayland's Haunt. Thank you. Uh, don't care. Go away. Thank you. Jack has just improved his skill point to cooking skill three. Well done, Jack. Chefs at the restaurant were eagerly awaiting your entry, but you astounded all with your lack of effort. Oh dear, G Play. Could it be that you were imprisoned again? That's the second time, boy. You need to watch it. Chefs at the restaurant were eagerly awaiting yours as well. Oh, Ryan, what was wrong? Oh, I forgot. You were flirting with a celebrity police officer at the beach. And G Play has left work today, earning 163 simoleons. Nice one. Missed you at the party, Ryan. Blah, blah, blah. And back again. Okay. Come on, sweetheart. Now, that's the Lara Croft outfit I was telling you in the previous episode that we tried to plan out for her. Looks kind of, um... Ah. <laughs> okay. Seems she can't actually do anything at that moment in time. Let's have a check at the vampire haunt. See if we can do something there instead. Where's... Oh, that's only here. Ah! Open from two till two. Hmm. Right. -ho. So what's she going to do until then? I mean, what time is it? It's quarter to four in the morning. There's not really that much to do around here at quarter to four in the morning. She could go to sleep, but I think she's only just woken up. Let's check. Yeah, her energy is fine. She doesn't need to do any more of that boring stuff, does she? Um, right, let's send you home. Okay. And see if there's something fun to do once we get there. If only all cab journeys were that fast. Okay, let's see. Before you start doing stuff, Let's see if there's something we can actually get you to do. Oh, look. G plays out of bed. I'm wearing nothing but a skimpy pair of underwear. We really have to have a closer look. Oh, wow. Athletic. Hello, G play. <laughs> well, what can I say? He's based on me. Ha <laughs> ha. I wish I had a physique like that. Okay. Oh, I forgot they've got a driveway. Maybe they could buy a car. How much money have they got? <gasps> oh, not enough for a car. Oh, well. Actually, let's just leave you to do what you want to do, because that's always, usually, where the more interesting stuff happens. You've gone to bed. What about Jack? Jack, what are you... Oh, you're still in bed. G-Play? You're sitting on the sofa. Okay. And you're watching children's programs, too. I really don't understand this family. And it's Jack's birth, though. Shizer, I was hoping to send him to university, but... Sod it. That's going to have to be another child in this family. Okay, it's Jack's birthday. Let's get him a cake. Buy mode. And, um, where is it? Sort by function. Here we go. Kids? Would it be kids? I don't know. Would it be vehicles? No. Oh, birthday cake under vehicles. How stupid am I? No. Um, oh, it's got to be around here somewhere. Where would it be? People? People. Viewers. You lot. Tell me. Where's the cake? Entertainment. It would be entertainment. And part right. Okay. Fantastic. Birthday cake. And it's not going there. And it's not going there either. Where's... Why not? Why can't I place the birthday cake? Ah. And it's placed. We have a birthday cake. Yay. Got to get him some balloons as well. Can't have a party without balloons. Okay. Here we go. There we go. And he's got some balloons. He can't complain. Birthday cake and balloons. What more can anybody want on their birthday? Okay, Jack, wake up so that we can celebrate your birthday. 
next episode. Because <laughs> we've just run out of time. Guys, that's all we've got time for. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave some comments in the comment section about which expansion pack you'd like me to install. And we can start playing on that one next week. So, like I said, I will catch you next time. Make sure to hit the like and subscribe button. For those of you who don't know, that's what I call sub-liking. And I will see you. When you live. Well, I won't see you. You'll see me. Well, you won't see me. You'll hear me. I'm going to shut up. I'm getting convoluted. Ciao for now.